<laughs> Wait, I heard what? You I heard you got up. No, David had his ears. I was like, I was like, I don't know why I thought it was like you know thigh meat getting stuck no, to the leather. That was me. Then I did some reach for this. I'm like, what? Let me just make my way to out this video. <laughs> these beans running through me like. <laughs> They even looked at me like, <laughs> and I was supposed to start laughing, but I'm like, no, he talking so professional. I don't want to do this. So you Terrible. just pooping? That is crazy. I, need to. I ain't cutting that out. <laughs> <laughs> Matter of fact, I put this in the beginning of the video. Oh. David, put this. David, David, put this in the beginning of the video. <laughs> Oh, you shithead. Yeah. One, two, three. What's up, Dan Gang? It's your boy, Dame Dash, and we're back. What the hell? What's, What's up, Dan Gang? Gang? It's your boy, Dame, Dame Dash, Dash, and we're, we're back, back with another video for What we doing today? Taco, Taco Friday. Friday. It's a fiesta. Wednesday, Friday. Huh? Say it's a fiesta. All right, y'all. So, this is Aria's mom, Crystal. Say hi, Aria. Okay, she's being a, a jerk right now. Uh, but anyway, we're having a Mexican feast. If you don't know, this light is in the way. It's a little bright. Shine bright like a diamond. Can you see it? Mm -hmm. Shine bright like a diamond. Who is that? Is that the man with the coronas? Oh, it's the man with the plan. Oh, my brother just walked in. We're having a family cooking slash mukbang. Long overdue. Yes. How y'all doing? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're so close. <laughs> Thank you. All right, so. She is part. What are you mixed with? Mexican, mm -hmm. Irish, mm -hmm. but I love my Mexican side, so I like to cook a lot of Spanish food. Yes. It's more of a Tex-Mex style. Okay. Real authentic Mexican food doesn't really right. consist of stuff like this. But oh, it don't. Tex-Mex style. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, and that's what we're finna do you right now. So we just take a lot of cilantro. And give it a rough chop. Oh, I like this cream. Put it in a bowl. Some garlic. Some garlic. And I put a lot of everything. Because most, most of it's going to come off when you take it out because you have beer so I put a lot of cilantro a lot of garlic I'm gonna put two limes I got a uh, lemon you squeezer you do you know you do uh, this is my brother from the same mother from the same mother that's Arya's dad yeah, sure will. Eat. hey everybody all the way. All the way. Yep. All right. Need all the juice. The more lime juice, the better. Lime hey, juice is what that. sets it off. Hey, little baby. Why are you crying, Aria? Daddy, what are you doing? Helping out your mother. So it's a hurry up, Uncle Video. But I want to do that too, Daddy. Mm -hmm. Here, do this one. Here. Squeeze. Really hard. Ready? You see it coming out? Good job! Can I do that on my I know, 
one now. Here? Hey, mommy. No, thank you. I don't need it right now. And just pour it in here. I want pour it in too. So right now it's cilantro, garlic, and beer. Cilantro, lemon, garlic, and Corona. You can put whatever type of beer. Modelo is really good, but Corona has a really good flavor with the steak. Stop. And then I just put a couple of onions. It doesn't matter how you put them up. Go get your chair out of the office, just to. And then a little bit of salt. Ooh, it's making it bubble. <laughs> I prefer um, sea salt, like a grinded up sea salt. Oh, there's some in the uh, cabinet. Some pink Himalayan. Pink, yeah. I heard, I heard that stuff just died. I don't know. I never, never really thought about it. <laughs> the cilantro flavor is gonna come out really good in this too, with the lime, mm -hmm. and it's gonna, it's gonna have a. a what the I'm, heck? There's just a head. A head just popped up out of nowhere. You can't see. Hmm. I can really see. You want to make sure to grab all the cilantro Mommy, from the bottom. Um, no, you have dirty hands. No, my hands are clean. No, they're not. Mix all the garlic. I don't want to do that. Everything kind of falls to the bottom. Mommy, I thought you were touching me. Nope. Daddy. And then just put this in the fridge for for maybe 15 minutes. Okay. Really, if you do it for like two, three hours, it's going to be off the chain, but we don't have two, three hours because two, three hours. we're hungry. Ain't that right, Papua? Ain't we hungry? We hungry. Yes. We ready to eat. Ready to eat. And your nose is running. Yeah, I hold it. Go get some tissue. I want to do that. Go get I some tissue. I like cold people to die. Warm people to die has a different... Okay. So I already cut up the onions because as Damon witnessed. She cried. It was a lot of tears. <laughs> you know, I like salt, but not, you know, my own salt tears. <laughs> so just dice them up small or big, however you like them. I don't like to bite into big crunchy onions, so I try not to have big crunchy onion pieces. Okay, so there's the onions. You want a decent amount of cilantro. Is your, no, is your nose clean? No. No. Well, why are you back? No. Hi. Hi. I thought I said you would get it. Girl. I thought washed you. And with, um, I mean, yeah. For the cilantro, I just try to roll it up a little bit. Okay. And then chop it up. Not super small, but you don't want you know whole leaves in there. You want to bring out the flavor of it. Right. Sometimes cilantro can be a little overpowering. This it's a, it's be. very strong. It can be. It can be. You use the Roman? I use Roman tomatoes. Yeah, they do. I almost forgot about the most important thing. I love that in guacamole. Um, do you know that this is the hot part of the jalapeno? The seeds. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's what makes it hot. I think to kind of be equal, where they say. Never use like measuring cups for rice because you just put, if you use one bowl of rice, you put two bowls of water. You put two cups of rice, four cups of water. Okay. You know, I never knew, well, my grandma always used to make rice like that. Like, you know, fresh rice, mm -hmm. I guess, or from the bag. And I never learned how to do it because it's a lot of work. So I just buy this. No. Nope. <laughs> you just let it sit there. Just 
But I, I've noticed that um, this, I don't see many people like, especially in Detroit, mm -hmm. they boil the rice and then they drain the water out of mm -hmm. it. And I never knew that people did their rice like that. So how do you do it? So we just put a little bit of grease because you don't want a lot. Mm -hmm. And then you just get, get the grease all over the rice. And then you just let it cook a little bit. Keep stirring it because it'll burn really quickly. Mm -hmm. So what is this? This brown rice? No, this is gonna be well. It's gonna be orange when it's done. Mm -hmm. It's gonna be like a chicken tomato rice. Oh, okay. So you just keep moving it around, and as you cook it, it you see everything. It starts to turn. It starts to turn white. Okay, so this this how you cook it the whole way, or do you no, add water? No, nope, you're gonna add two bowls of water. Okay. So uh, this is right here. Get your first bowl. Cook, cook, cook. Everybody does stuff different, but you know, this is how I was taught. See, not even taught. Nobody even taught me. I just watched. So that means. Don't come in the comment section. Talking crazy. That's not how you make rice. My grandma mm -hmm. told me how to soak it in the sink for 20 minutes. This is how she learned how to make rice. We're from Harlingen, Texas, and this is how they do it in Harlingen. Okay. That's in the valley. Don't come for her in the comments. Okay, it's my sister. That means I'm gonna snap back. I'm back. Oh, oh God, why? Oh, <laughs> say hi guys. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so one cup is ready. See, you don't have to get everything, but you do notice that there's, you know, a color change and everything. So, one cup. Okay, so in this spot right now, the camera was off, I'm sorry y'all. So we got the tomato. And the chicken bouillon. It's just powder, mm -hmm. but it's really good seasoning. Okay. So this is a tomato base and this is a chicken base. So you got to season to your taste. To your taste. And then we just have regular tomato sauce and you just pour some in. I used about three quarters of a can, but the trick to making good rice is to mix everything together and taste your broth. What your broth tastes like is what your rice is going to taste like. Okay. So if, you're, if your water is bland, then your rice is not going to have no flavor. Okay. So. And don't judge my can, our can up when they're broke, so I use the knife <clears throat> as the ghetto way. You know, it is what it is. You know, some people got can openers, some people don't. Some people have can openers that don't work. Yeah. And it's okay, and we don't judge those type of people. We won't name any names. She judging me. I'm judging him because I got one, but listen. And who keeps a broken can opener? Just for people can just for purposes just like this. So when you be like, you ain't got no can opener, yeah, I be like, yes but. I do, but it don't work. <laughs> got it right on the first try. That looks so good in there. So then you turn it down. Put your lid on, don't touch it, just let it cook. Don't touch it, just let them be. That's all you gotta do. That's the secret. I was told that too. Don't touch it. Cause you know, you gotta fluff it. Don't you gotta fluff it at some point? By the way to the end. Cause mm -hmm. I, like the, I like the bottom mm -hmm. to kind of get dark and then it creates like this little crunchy and you mix it in and mm -hmm. then every now and then you get this really good bite of crunchy. Oh, Crunchy rice. <laughs> I love it. No, not a bad crunchy. Oh, good crunchy. A good crunchy. Crunchy rice is not good. Okay, not crunchy like it ain't it's done. Like it's crunchy. not undercooked. If the oh. rice is cooked, uh -huh. but you know, like when you cook a steak, you got the little crunchy. Yes, like the brown pieces. pieces. Yes. It's like the caramel. Yes, and you can get that in oh, rice. I when like I cook the steak, I like to burn it. Like when I cook it, I, this mm, is on high time. temperature. No, I cook it on the grill, mm -hmm. and it gets nice and burnt. And but I, I hope the skillet is gonna do the same thing. So what's that? Just some pre-mixed seasoning. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Lemons? No, I'm good. I've never used this brand before, but it smells really good. 
Um, I can only assume is garlic powder, paprika, probably some chili powder, some cumin, onion powder, salt, pepper, basic Mexican ingredients. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, let's put some of that on the chicken. Extra seasoning. I think these are quarters. I think these are leg quarters. So it's thigh. Thigh and a leg. Oh, it was a leg in there? Yeah, I, I think they're boneless. No, I think they're quarters. Uh -oh. So that's the whole leg is the quarter. To this delicious marinated steak. This And for some reason, it takes a while for cilantro to burn, mm -hmm. but I still don't. You still don't want to have all the cilantro in there. Okay. I got better tongue. And you're just gonna cook it. That's it. Oh, give me that <laughs> This is the process so far. You see the crispiness on that steak. Look at that meat. Whoa. Is that a thigh? And a leg quarter. And a leg quarter. Look at this, y'all. Look at that meat. So what you doing over there? So now I'm gonna cook the hamburger for the tostadas. Um, so while it's frying, I'm gonna put some onions in it. Put the onions. This seasoning, this pico de gallo. You mind if say, this is what mukbangers do. <laughs> <laughs> We're smashing the beans. So these beans were in a crock pot overnight mm -hmm. where they have some um, onions and some bacon in them. Mm -hmm. And I just cooked them overnight. So these are from yesterday. Okay. And we're just mashing them up. We're gonna use these for the tostadas and some side beans if anybody wants beans on the side. Mm. So. What's up, Dane Gang? It's your boy Dame Dash, and we'll be back with another video for y'all. Hey, hey y'all! Did, did you, you miss, miss me? me? Got it! <laughs> this is the fourth time. <laughs> Alright, y'all, so I'm back with a video for y'all. If y'all didn't watch the, the clip before of my sister cooking all of this stuff, watch it. But this is Crystal. Well, Hello. hey, why do I always say the person's name? You can say your arm. I am Crystal. I have we have voices. Right. I'm Dante. And these are are your parents. The mom. The <laughs> the uncle. <laughs> All right, y'all. So just tell them what we have here. So today we have some Mexican fiesta going on. Um right here on our plates we have a tostada with hamburger meat. There's beans, lettuce, and tomatoes. And on the side, we have some beans and some Mexican-style rice. Um, we have some lettuce and tomatoes, some avocado and some lemon, some whole pickled jalapenos. Um, we have some chicken and some steak, which was marinated in some really good marinating stuff. <laughs> stuff you marinate stuff in. Um, we have some fresh pico de gallo, some grilled peppers, um, some queso fresco cheese. We have 
flour and corn tortillas and some hamburger meat for our tostadas. Tell them, <sighs> All right, y'all, and I'm hungry. Let's do a thumbnail, y'all. Okay. What y'all want to do for the thumbnail? You want to hold chicken. the hold the chicken? Mm-hmm. I'm gonna hold this. What's that? <laughs> you hold the fl- <laughs> Come on, let's take one. You gotta see the whole oh chicken. wait, oh man. Oh jalapeno. <laughs> uh, yeah. No, I'm gonna hold my plate. Oh, good one. <laughs> I hope I ain't black as hell. <laughs> I feel attacked. Oh, oh man, hold on. You know what? I could be done to turn that light a little. All right, so I'm ready to eat, y'all. Okay. What do you so, eat first? What I would do, mm. I would get me a chicken. Follow the leader. Okay. I'm going to get me some steak. I guess this just to fill out our plate for now. Look at um, Nice and crispy. Yeah, crispy steak. Crispy steak. Chicken too. Nice and, nice and crispy. Mm. I really don't know what a lot of this tastes like. It was good. I haven't tasted it yet, so. Oh, yeah. I got sour cream. They was talking about, we don't eat sour cream with this. I mm-hmm. love sour cream. You can take the whole piece of meat. Dang. Put it in there. Oh, we didn't get no silverware for them. I guess we'll use our forks. I like this. Hmm? <laughs> <laughs> no, I think we need some utensils. Like some spoons. Hey, you see this, y'all? Mm-hmm. What's that in? Because you need some pico. Uh, you didn't get no pico, no peppers. Oh, what no about from cheese. the cheese? We can use the spoon from the cheese. You didn't get no avocado. So, what are we doing? This? I would throw the whole piece of meat on there. Mm-hmm. Grab me one of him. All right. Grab me a lime. You know, the more lime you got, the better. Get you some cheese. You put gua- uh, gua- guacamole? Yep. I mean, avocado. Yo, we quiet right now. They, like, <laughs> they ain't even thinking, they ain't talking. I'm trying to eat. Ooh, I'm on. But we've been talking about this video for a week now, okay? Mm-hmm. And it's finally here. We had to wait till Friday. Got some... Salsa verde in a can jar, you know. Good brand though. We drove by this place in Chicago, and I didn't think they were as I'm authentic as they were. Oh, pepper is on my. Oh yeah. Oh shoot. Oh yeah. Oh, oh yeah. This kind of this like um, this like Qdoba. Oh, this the sauce they be having. They got a lot. They got black beans. Ooh. Pinto beans. Oh, I ain't put no lime. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all should have used a flour tortilla. Oh, yeah. I ain't gonna get no lettuce. Mm-hmm. I can't even stuff it. This is fat. Mm-hmm. Look at that. It is hey, you, gotta, you gotta take the skin off. <laughs> what, bro? <laughs> Look at that. Avocado. <laughs> Yo, it's eating a skin on this avocado. <laughs> you know I'll be ready to eat this day. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, woman. Mm-hmm. 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 It is good though. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Straight out of Dame Dash's kitchen. Mm. This is the best feeling when you eat a home cooked meal and you ain't cook it. Mm-hmm. Did you? Hmm? Yeah. Did you put break your tostada in half? Yeah. <laughs> that's not a, that's not how you eat a tostada. I keep it straight. That's how you eat it. You gotta tell us. Mm. Oh, mm-hmm. I knew that. Mm-hmm. From last time. Mm. Well, this what I'm about to do with this one. Yo, we're going to talk in a minute. <laughs> it's so good, though. Mm. It's like there's so much more that we haven't even ate yet. Mm, 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 mm. And then once you 
Take some of the chicken off the bone and put it in the taco. Mm-hmm. 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 Mm -hmm. It's the sauce. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> wow. <laughs> okay, Aria. This is Aria get her clumsy. That's exactly. Because that is exactly what Aria mm -hmm. would have done. I'm oh, sorry. sorry, Uncle. I'm sorry, y'all. Oh, I got open mouth. I told you to do it in the sink. It might explode a little. It looks like it went down though. It's thirsty though. Mm, nope. <laughs> mm. I told them. Mm. I left them in the freezer too long. Mm. I forgot all about them. Oh, it's good though. Mm hmm. Haritos. 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 Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. This tastes way it. better than the fountain. <laughs> Super. Oh my goodness. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Well. Mm. Here you go, sweetie. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> Don't call me sweetie. My name is Arya Nelson. <laughs> <clears throat> Ari is learning how to spell her name. Ooh, what letter does she leave out? I. She leaves out I every, every time. time. Yeah. Mm -hmm. it, we kind of spelled it funky. Mm. Everyone else who spells her name, they don't spell it like that. I know, cause they be spelling it in the comments. Like, you know, what spelling is right. Nope. <laughs> I be like, I don't know if you spelling the right. Are we spelling the wrong. These tacos. I mean, we mm. named her, so Good. I don't mm. think we could spell it wrong. Uh -uh. But everyone else doesn't put a Y in it. It's just I. A R oh, yeah. I A. Ooh, this looks so good. Oh, it's so good too. Oh, look at that, y'all. Are you dancing? <laughs> Boy. Mm. That means I did something right, right? Oh, mm. Because I've been with you for five years. <laughs> oh, yeah. Tell them how y'all met, how long y'all been together. Better. <laughs> Met her five years ago. Actually, <clears throat> September 26th will be five years. Wow. Yeah, so it's actually coming up. But our love story started on Instagram. That's the truth. Thank you. And I came to Detroit. We met. Been together since the day we met. Got a lovely mm. daughter. Yep. Aria Venice Nelson. And y'all know her very well. <laughs> yeah. That's, the, that's what happened. Mm, 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 mm. <clears throat> yep. It's been a it's been a long road. Yeah. It's so funny because when she was pregnant the first time, when our mom was living. She had said that she was gonna have a girl. Oh, I wanted a boy so bad. Mm -hmm. Did you think you was having a boy at one point? And we were all one hundred percent convinced that we were having a boy. Yes, we was one hundred percent, and there was not a doubt in our mind. We thought that the shape of her knees was that determined that that she was a boy. That's how much we wanted a boy. Um, what was that? He fell out of the chair when he when the doctor said it was a girl. Archie son. I started crying. I think I was crying. What you mean? <laughs> mm. I already knew what it was gonna be like. I knew how these two were. They were high fashion, expensive clothes. All that stuff. <laughs> I'm like having a little girl with these two? Oh man. And four years later, my worst fears have come true. <laughs> She's a diva. She's spoiled rotten. All that, baby. She's a daddy's girl. Mm hmm Man, she's a daddy's girl. That's crazy. I want my daddy. Every day. What about me? She cried when I picked her up from school. Some of my daddy's supposed to come pick me up. You're not my dad. You're my uncle. I said, they told me to come get you. But why would he do that? Call them. <laughs> I'll be like, you know what? Get in the car. 
Mm-hmm. She just got a soft spot when it comes to her daddy. Oh, shoot. Ain't no joking. Mm-mm. <clears throat> Excuse me. Because he play. He play with her. Like, he will literally get on the floor. Mm-hmm. Girl, we ain't got no soft shells over here. Mm-hmm. Oh. <clears throat> You're a little hidden. He will literally get on the floor and play with her like like a kid. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I'll be she like, can you play with me? Huh? What you wanna play? Um, I'm the mom and you're the dad. I'll be like, you wanna want me to build you a tent? She's like, yeah, I'll build a tent. Uh-huh. Then after I build it, she's like, you gonna get in it? <laughs> no. <laughs> Mommy built that tent. She got she had a tent on mm-hmm. right now for about four days. For real? About Did you use two chairs? Three. Nope, I put it over her bed. Cause uh-huh. one part of her bed, the the foot rails mm-hmm. is low and the headboard is high. So it created like an arch. And then I open up the little window, <laughs> and she watches her movies at night. For real, bro. That's mm-hmm. lit. Yep. I just put two of the dining room chairs together and put a sheet over mm-hmm. it. And put her a blanket and inside and a pillow, and she was in there watching her iPad. Mm-hmm. <laughs> she loves that whole tent idea. Tell them how you made, how you made the tent. She just mm-hmm. did. Her tent was well, lit. You, you nigger rigged it. <laughs> <laughs> She put four hangers. I put the hangers that have the clamps. Oh, for it wouldn't fall mm-hmm. down. Oh, mine's kept falling down. I didn't think about that. Mm-hmm. I had to oh. improvise. Because I was trying to get her to go to bed. Mm-hmm. And you know her, she's going to stay up and fight with you. Mm-hmm. And she slept in her own bed? Mm-hmm. Every night. Every night, bro. Because of the tent. Mm-hmm. Even without the tent, she sleeps in her bed. Look at Jesus. Yep. That is what's up. She loves she I mean she doesn't love it but we don't give her a choice. Right. She didn't do. <clears throat> Sleep on the couch with us. We stay up till two or three in the morning. You got me messed up. Bed upstairs. Yeah. We wake up at seven o'clock in the morning tired as hell. That's the thing when you just gotta drop her off and come back home. <laughs> we don't though. Oh y'all we be out up. the whole day? Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Yup. No, but I have two. Like when I um drop her off. To stay up? Mm-hmm. Woo! That's my whole day. I might as well get everything done. Basically, mm-hmm. that's the start of the day. It's a good schedule to be on. Y'all know that's new for us. Whew, man. We're used to sleeping till... Even Ari is used to sleeping till 12, 1, 2. This chicken is so good. Is <laughs> it? He was about to say that. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yes. This chicken is good. I can't do that, man, because I broke it. I thought you ate it like a taco. No. Like this. Like, and it has a totally different it. taste than a taco. <clears throat> it just tastes different. This chicken is slaps. Oh, it bro. is good. <clears throat> but are you going to school? This is our first year going to school, so this is all new for all of us, you know. Everything that we learn with Aria is the first time any of us have ever done it before. Mm-hmm. No cap. Especially with somebody that is our own child. You might see other people do it, but it's definitely different when you have your own kid. Mm-hmm. It's so exciting, though. It is. She came in the car today when we picked her up. The first thing she said was, I had a great day at school today. That was the <laughs> first thing she said, and she had this big old smile on her face. And every day, that's what she said. Have, I had a good day. What'd you do? We practice our letters. We wrote down our numbers. Everything. She got mad at me because I said her teacher name wrong. I said, wow. Sandy. Sa- what is Snyder. It? Snyder. Mm-hmm. Baby Snyder. Shout out to her school because they are doing something really right if they got her convinced that school is what's up. Mm-hmm. And she loves it every day. That's how I wake her up. You ready for school? Yeah, good morning. <laughs> every morning. Okay. Positive note. Positive. As it should be, right? Mm Mm-hmm. I think that's why she gets so excited, because we make it such a big deal for her. Yeah. And that's always... I think that's why also she got potty trained so quick, because we were so enthusiastic about it, and that helped so much. Yes, it do. Especially when she's like, I'm a big girl, and then you tell her she's not a big girl... Oh, she mad. She's going to prove to you mm-hmm. how big of a girl she is. Mm-hmm. Oh, the name of this video is going to be Raising Aria. <laughs> mm. That's what I want the name of my restaurant to be. Aria's. Aria's. 
That's always been there, hasn't it? Mm-hmm. That's dope. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Did I put this in there? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And I don't know how I would want to open a restaurant, though. Yes, you do. Like, would I, would I cook everything I know how to cook? But that's too many different things. Like, Yeah, you cook everything. Would you stick to one different thing? Like, should I open up a taco shop where you get, like, this I don't know. Oh. I don't yeah. I wouldn't want to open up a restaurant. Not a but restaurant. a certain thing because I like to make different stuff. And yeah, I thought like that restaurant limits you. is limited. Unless you, you got specials. What do you do? Have one side of a menu Italian, the hmm. other side Latin food, American food, soul food. Every day is a different theme, but that's too much. Mm-hmm. I've been scoping out this building too. Unless you do like specials. You have a week long. Mm hmm. Sauce is still on the table. (laughs) Y'all. We ain't getting up. up, We (laughs) eat it. Look, this pop is so good. Caritos. And that was 79 cents somewhere. They are very inexpensive. Oh. And they're so good. Lime and pineapple. Are seriously the best. At and Kroger. It's a nice thing I've seen. Guava is really good, too. You guys need a lot? Yeah. Mm. Mm-hmm. I don't know what I want now. You make a fajita. Chicken fajita. Steak fajita. I know. Fajita. I just had a chick. Fa- chi- a chick. <laughs> This is lit, y'all. Can you taste the Corona in the steak? Yes, it's really good. Mm-hmm. Y'all gotta try that recipe and let us know. Let us know, let us know. Don't get me at the door. <laughs> I'm sleepy, y'all. I need to be getting some sleep after this video because I will be seeing you guys in Ohio today. So... If you missed this video, because it might come around 5 o'clock, <laughs> I already done left Ohio. <laughs> I'm probably already back home. I'm probably already back home. Doing another video. You know. Mm-hmm. So Stay busy. I'll catch y'all next time. But I had a good time, hopefully. I'm sure I'm, sure I'm going to have a good time. What's that? How Arya eats good. At home and here. Yeah. She's gonna have a uh, what you call it a pallet, a she, real. She when she was when she was like maybe six months old, mm. she would eat salmon, mm-hmm. and fish, and asparagus. Her she has never been picky, and I'm so happy because I'm not picky. I am so far from picky. I love peppers and fruits and vegetables. That's crazy because she picky. With me, she had to say something like, Oh, I don't like that. <laughs> Same stuff. She did not eat. But you know, one thing she was eating and it was creeping me out? What? Mussels. Really? Oh, like I that. saw her eat one. I did. I did. She was tearing them mussels up. Yep. It, yep, I was surprised. I was like, All right, that don't look weird. She's like, no, I the like texture, them. Texture, like she was cool with the mm-hmm. texture. Mm-hmm. I thought because it looked weird, you'd be like, boy, you are a bad muck banger. You full? Man, we don't get full. <laughs> That's the point of muck bangs. <laughs> I gotta show them how to eat chicken, like. <laughs> He been spoiled all his life. Man, uh, that's for real. I am kind of full. Hey, it um, you ate. Ain't you better burp. Much. You better burp. Well, yeah, that's my little brother. <laughs> if y'all don't know that, he's younger than me. Yeah. This hamburger, y'all. Mhm. Where we got hamburger steak and chicken. Mhm. Mm-hmm. Y'all went out. <laughs> y'all, that's custom. Right. I just filmed it for y'all. 
<laughs> hey, it with this. Mm-hmm. Mm. Yeah. This is about to knock me out. I swear. I swear. Mm. I could eat this every day. And it's terrible. Mm. And tomorrow we're starting keto. Mm. Saturday we start keto, y'all. <laughs> this was the last shebang right here. This ain't on keto? Mm-mm. It's, it's, majority of this could be on keto. Peppers, so you this, still had a meat. chicken, steak, yes. Mm-hmm. They just switch up a couple ingredients, and that's it. It's the way you cook it? Mm-hmm. 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 Look, I got avocado one more time. Mm-hmm. The biggest one? <laughs> I'm going to want the biggest one. <laughs> <laughs> mm-hmm. Thanks, bro. Mm-hmm. You got to take it off for him so he wouldn't forget. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> he said, oh, you want the biggest one? No, oh, shoot, I ain't know. There's some bigger ones over there. Yeah. Mm, mm. yeah. Oh, yeah. This chicken, though? Mm. That that pico de gallo seasoning, I highly recommend it. Oh. I put that seasoning and that, I, I chopped up some onions and just put that one seasoning in that hamburger meat and it came out so good. Good. I'm full. <laughs> mm. <clears throat> whoop. Whoop, 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 whoop. It was worth the wait. It was worth the cook. Mm-hmm. And this set it off. Oh, yeah, I'm going to have to go. Check your local stock Mexican up. stores, Walmarts, Kroger's. I'm going to stock up on you. In the Spanish aisle or ethnic foods. Mm-hmm. I walk past these all the time. This is the first one you Second, I had a little sip, but this is my first time having my own. Mm-hmm. I had a sip of some um, a beans. Mm-hmm. Beans, yeah, that's my brother. Mm-hmm. Call my loose daddy. Mm. <laughs> this chicken good. I don't care. Oh, I'm about to stuff overdo it. Oh yeah, look at this skin. For real. Oh my god. Uh. Mm. I'm on taco number five. You were just on number three two seconds ago, so I <laughs> jumped to five. Right. <laughs> the camera know I'm not lying. <laughs> For real. This chicken was two ninety nine a pound. What? Uh, mm-hmm. Where do you get this from? Southwest Detroit, Little Mexico. Mm. That's the, the name of the stuff? As Azteca. Yep. Azteca, really good. Um, they got really good meat. Pre-seasoned meat, really good um, steaks, thin-cut steaks, nice thick steaks, nice fresh vegetables. Mm. <sighs> I need to just stop. You know, you just full. I feel like I'm about to be to that floor where you uncomfortable. Mm-hmm. <laughs> huh? That's what you do. You got your way? No. I said, what about the bathroom? Huh? You gotta go boop boop? No. The place is not this. Oh, I'm not even talking talk about that. Mm. I'll tell you off camera. <laughs> <laughs> mm 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 mm. mm. No, you can't judge a book by its cover. Mm-hmm. This day and age, you know, gotta take the good with the bad. <laughs> you know. <clears throat> yeah, I am about full. Yep, I can't wait till tomorrow to eat this again. Mm. Cause that's what I'm gonna do. Cause I'm gonna keto tomorrow. But you know, tomorrow afternoon. <laughs> 
I'll what? eat this for breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> and then for dinner, we'll start keto. What? The, the, he sh- man, that's, you should have just went with it. Damn. <laughs> Put me right under the bus. What about keto? <laughs> head Dang. Uh, Put me on blood. He He's like, didn't answer. you literally just say, I ain't say nothing, but I require, I ain't say nothing. You're on camera. I ain't say nothing. I plead the fit. That was not me. Oh my god. It's not me, y'all. You about to make me poop. That was Skip, okay? This is Crystal. My nickname of 15 Ugh. years has been Skip. That was Skip. Ooh, that's because she skipped over the truth. <laughs> <laughs> There's no evidence of anything. What is keto? Oh, man. It sounds like uh, exercise. I feel like I need keto right now in the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> I think these refried beans trying to re-enter. <laughs> these refried beans are about to exit. Mm-mm. No, no, don't come out. Mm. Not yet. Let it sit there for a minute. Oh my god. I'm still eating. I know. I swear, my stomach. We can't do this. We used to meet us kids. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I'm full. I don't know what they're talking about. We about to lead a mukbang. Who's the? <laughs> I'm gonna let the camera keep going. <laughs> it's just us, y'all. Mm. They they must. Ooh. I think they just eat fast. Mm. I don't think. I don't think I ate as much as y'all. Hmm? I don't think I ate as much as y'all. I know it could be me drinking this because this got me. This I could have drunk all my drink. Not the drink. I'm black as hell in this picture. I mean, this video. Good, good tan. Oh my god. Yeah, boy. This was fun. <laughs> Period. Go. I'm still eating. Period, poo. <laughs> oh, excuse me. I am done, though, because I am full. They're going to be like, why that young man had that hat and glasses on during the whole video? <laughs> I'm like, he, he was shy. He didn't want to have his glasses on. <laughs> they always be talking about me. Why you always got a hat on? Wow, I always ain't got a haircut. Maybe he bald. What if Maybe. it was a sub- sensitive subject? <laughs> well, I don't like my hair. It's a little thin this time around. <laughs> <laughs> this is really good. Man, Bravo, who Bravo. other one is that on the corner? That's just a... <laughs> you have it, bro. <laughs> it's my baby. Dips. <laughs> <laughs> Man, this is good. Bro, you're going to taste this one. You got that one. you about to be mm-hmm. like, ooh. Bro, this one the true. Oh, my God. Back at it again. Mm-hmm. I didn't mean to do all this. Yep. Gajaritos. <sighs> I didn't eat these jalapenos at all. And there's a carrot in there. The carrots are so good. Future reference, eat the carrot. It's a lot of peppers. <laughs> uh-huh. I don't know why. I can't believe he folded his tostada in half like a taco. Like, it looks like a BK taco. For yes. But these peppers look so good. Oh. Oh. Just drinking oh. my jaritos. I'm asleep over here, y'all. I know it's the real one. <laughs> Wait, I heard what? You I you got up. No, I was like, I was like, I was like, I was like, I don't know why I thought it was like, you know, thigh meat getting stuck to the leather. No, that was me. Then I did some of reach for this. <laughs> 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 I'm like, well, let me just make my way to out this video. <laughs> these beans running through me. Like, <laughs> They kind of looked at me like, <laughs> and I was about to start laughing, but I'm like, no, he talking so professional. I don't want to do this. So you just poop it. That is crazy. I, need to. I ain't cutting that out. <laughs> Matter of fact, I'll put this in the beginning of the video. Oh. David, put this. David, David, put this in the beginning of the video. <laughs> 
Why you said that, babe? You said it. That was point. funny. Look, you came back and ate more food. I'm, I'm about to be next. This is my point. It might be wet, though. All right, so look, y'all. End of discussion. We about to get up out of here. I love y'all so much. Hopefully, you learned something. Yes. About cooking something. Try something. Mm-hmm. You know, try the, the steak marinade mm-hmm. off the chain. And that chicken. That was good. So, make sure y'all leave comments down below because she's going to watch them. She reads the comments. She checks the comments. And I she randomly, responds. I randomly do it. <laughs> I randomly... I will randomly comment on a bunch of stuff. <laughs> so, yeah. So, um, show her some love, y'all. I love y'all so much. Thank y'all for 70K. We got 70K. Almost oh, 100. That's, that's what's next. Man, I cannot wait to hit 100. I'm going to go crazy. I'm going to do a giveaway every day. $55, but still. I love, I love y'all. Please make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Share this video with anyone and everyone. Let them know what we doing over here. Big things. You know. <laughs> love ya. Peace. Peace. Love ya. Peace.